A classroom became the tenant's shield of protection as they endured Elkhorn's tornado inside Blue Sage Elementary. Um, pretty scary. Sirens blared just before pickup. Laura was waiting for her son Johnny and went inside to take shelter. They were reunited and waited out the storm with 700 others. We came back to very calm teachers, very calm kids. Nine-year-old Johnny chatted with friends and watched a movie. We were watching the magic school bus. Laura worked to stay calm as she got updates from her husband in law enforcement. I was trying to not share with this guy because he said there's a bullseye on our house right now, which is really close to the school. But with the school's reinforced doors and windows, Laura felt safe. Much safer than I would have felt in our new construction home, yeah. Principal Amy Christ says the twister's timing was a blessing, allowing them to protect parents, students, and teachers. It was the most unperfect, perfect time. She says staff did everything right. Before I could even make the call to go to shelter and follow our standard response protocols, they were already headed that direction. Kelsey McDonald stayed calm on the outside. I think there was a little bit more of a nervous energy inside. The school's tornado drills made her feel prepared. I think just the fact that we practice these things over and over and over. It's a day they'll never forget, and a lesson Laura says the destruction made very clear. I think it makes us take it a little more, a little more seriously. The tenant's barn is destroyed, but both their home and the school are okay. Laura says she's grateful to the school's actions to, for keeping everybody safe. Live in Elkhorn, Jessica Perez, KTV News Watch 7.